Hi everyone, in this video, let us understand, what is Profi Bus, and Profi Bus Connectors, and Specifications. Profi Bus means Process Field Bus, and is a standard communication in automation technology. In 1989, by the German department, BMBF, Federal Ministry of Education and Research, promoted the use of Profi Bus, then later it's used by Siemens and is published as part of, IEC 61158. Profi Bus is classified into Profi Bus FMS, Field Bus Message Specification, and Profi Bus DP, Decentralized Peripherals. Profi Bus FMS is a peer to peer messaging format. And it is used for communication of data between Profi Bus masters. Profi Bus DP is a protocol made for communication between Profi Bus masters and their remote I.O. slaves. In later 1993, for the Profi Bus classification, one more communication type is added, that is Profi Bus PA, process automation, is used to monitor, the equipment value of the process control system, in process automation applications. Next, let us see the Profi Bus protocol, with the reference of the OSI model. The OSI has the seven layers, and Profi Bus has three layers. Layer 7 is application layer, and layers from 3 to 6 of the OSI model, are not used in the Profi Bus protocol, and Datalink layer is a security layer, and physical layer is a bit transmission layer. The three Profi Bus versions, FMS, DP, and PA, all use a standard bus access protocol. Application layer, which determines the three different, DP protocol functions, DPv0 for the cyclic, I.O. communication and diagnosis, DPv1 for acyclic data, exchange and alarm handling, DPv2 for the slave-to-slave -slave communication. The next security layer, is known as the FDL, field bus data link, which handles the data transmission between, the master-to-master -master devices, and master-to-slave devices. It adopts the token passing technique. And it handles both data security, and error detection. Next bit transmission layer. Here the data can be transmitted, either by electrical transmission EIA 485, twisted pair cables or optical transmission. Most commonly used topologies are star, bus, and ring topology. Profi bus DA and Profi bus PA, have different bit rates. The data transmitted in the byte format, and each byte is secured with even parity and transferred asynchronously, with a start and stop bit. The frame has, SD start delimiter, LE, length of data, la repetition of length data, FC function code, DA destination address, SA source address, DSAP destination service access point, SSAP source service access point, PDU protocol data unit, protocol data, FCS frame checking sequence, ED, end delimiter. Profi bus cable communication, is based on RS-485. Profi bus uses two core twisted cable, to communicate. It is used to interface controllers, like PLC with slave modules, repeater stations, sensors, HMIs, ASI interface, actuators, etc. Profi bus cable has two wire, red and green wire covered with an inner sheath, with tape shield. And drain wire covered with braided shield, and all these are covered with outer PVC sheath. The Profi bus cable is identified by the color of cable, it has a standard color code that is violet. The speed rate of the Profi bus DP, and PA are different. Profi bus DP has speed rate of, 9.6 kilobits per second to 12 megabits per second, and it can be used 100 to 1200 meter length. Profi bus PA has fixed speed rate of, 31.25 kilobits per second, and it can be used up to 1900 meter and it allows, up to 31 to 126 node devices, to connect. And if it's an optical transmission, then cable length can be used up to 15 km. Let's see the Profi bus connector. It's a 9-pin sub-D connector type. Pin number 3 is a positive line, and Profi bus green wire will be connected. Pin number 5, will be connected to ground. Pin number 6, is a positive power line, usually, plus 5 volts will be connected. Pin number 8 is a negative line, and Profi bus red wire will be connected. And on top of the Profi bus connector, you can find the switch, which used to terminate the node. If the termination switch is on, then the Profi bus connector will be terminated, and you can't connect to next node. If the termination switch is off, then the Profi bus will enable the connection to the next node. 
Every Profi bus station must have a unique address for communication. These Profi bus addresses are coded, in one byte and comprise the range, 0 to 125. For more informative technical videos, and training on industrial automation, visit our webpage www.trainingandplc.com